love to movie, movie bitches. bitches. Episode 82. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So we're still discussing what our 100th episode is going to be. We, we oh, yeah. figured it out. It seems like it'll probably be in like August or September. <laughs> so we got some time. <laughs> we'll see what's coming out around Maybe then. Maybe we'll do Showgirls 2, Pennies from Heaven. No, oh, just because. I mean... For obvious reasons. For obvious reasons. <laughs> Who knows? We're, anyway. We're figuring, we're figuring it out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, tonight we're reviewing Zootopia. <laughs> Zootopia is yeah. the new Disney animation movie. So all the animals live together in harmony and they're... They've like evolved over thousands of years. They've evolved beyond to... being predator and prey and now they're all just like acting like humans and wearing clothes and like have jobs and stuff. They're all herbivores. I'm assuming. I'm assuming because where else, what else would they be eating? Unless they're eating humans. Oh god. Which, dark. This just added some car shit here. I mean, that is a good question. Like, what is this lion eating? They didn't address that. No. It's like, I don't know about this vegetarian lion. But, anyway. <laughs> yeah. Maybe there's like some Soylent Green shit happening under the surface. Exactly. It doesn't really matter because this movie is totally adorable and cute. It is totally adorable and cute. <laughs> like, I really so, like this movie. So, oh good. Oh, see, I didn't know. I you couldn't know? tell if you did or didn't. There were certain things that I was like, ooh, what's that? But overall, I really like this movie. I really liked it too. It was like adorable. It was. <laughs> so, okay. So this is the, it's the story of a little bunny. Yes. Who wants to become a cop and everyone tells her you can't be a cop. And she says, fuck you, I'm going to do it anyway. That's exactly what she says. <laughs> it's rated R. Um, <laughs> the rated R version has all the cannibalism happening. Exactly, yeah. She goes to the police academy to train, and there's like a whole montage, and it was very like G.I. Jane as a bunny. And I was... <laughs> All for it. <laughs> I was like, yes. I mean, I really wish they'd had her do some like one armed push ups. That would have been amazing. <laughs> that would have been hilarious. <laughs> like in the rain, just like, yes. <laughs> like, yes. Go there, movie. Go there. So, anyway. Um, she becomes a cop. Yep. And she like ends up kind of becoming buddy buddy with a fox <gasps> um, who she doesn't trust. Because he's a wily fox. Yep. But then it turns out that, you know, the stereotypes aren't all true. Yeah. And so, okay, so what I really liked about this movie was that it had, like, a moral and a lesson, but it wasn't Wally. It didn't Wally it. Oh, God, it was no Wally. You know? <laughs> it, was, it wasn't even Tomorrowland, where it was like, let's no. all recycle. Like, it wasn't even that. No. And maybe it's because it was a different message than humans have destroyed the planet. I mean, maybe they have, and that's why the animals, like, are well, uprising, maybe. and then they, like, took our history books, and, like, that's why they're dressing like us. And, and that's why there's jobs. a Natural Museum of History. <laughs> How but, like, amazing but, would it have been if the Natural Museum of History was all, like, human pop culture? Yes! I think I'm getting too dark. Yep. I loved the message of this movie. Don't stereotype, like... We all have to work together. Fear is not the answer. Exactly. Like, and so it was It was really well-timed, I think. With Super Tuesday? Yeah. <laughs> the whole movie I was like, oh my god. <laughs> I feel like Donald Trump used to watch Zootopia and like have some feelings about it. Like, I want to know what Donald Trump thinks about Zootopia. Yeah. I don't, because it's gross. Ooh. But like, I don't know how you could watch this movie and not be like, Oh, oh, we should, like, that's a really... Maybe good I shouldn't say that all Muslims should be banned from the country. Like, maybe that's a bad idea. Yeah. Ugh. 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 So anyway, yes, this yeah. movie's adorable. Um, I thought Jason Bateman did a great job. He's the voice of the fox. Yep. And he has, like, a tailspin thing going on, like, this, like, loose tie, and he's just, like, very blue and, like, cool. And I was like, yes, all of it. So the, Tommy Chung does a guest of Cheech and Chong. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. I didn't know that's who it was. The yak with the dread. Yeah. And the, I think he was a yak. They go to a naturalist colony, which is a nudist colony, and all the animals are naked, and it was really funny because they were like, oh my god, but it looks totally normal to you because it's an animal that's not wearing clothes, so it looks weird. Although it was a little weird that none of them actually had genitalia. I mean... Yeah. It, they were animated like normal animated animals they were, are. They were smooth. <laughs> yeah. It was a lot of Barbie I mean, doll smooth. Yeah, it was a little strange, but also funny. I mean, 
I wasn't that expecting was him to have like a big elephant penis hanging out. <laughs> Just a big old one. I thought all the moments of seriousness mm -hmm. were very well done and very serious. It was not fluffy. Like when he, when she, at the beginning of the movie, she gets beat up by this fox. Oh, I yes. was like, oh. It God. was like torment. It was, was like, like this is bullying is real. Setting. And then um, uh, Nick the fox, Jason Bateman, this character, tells his story about how he wanted to be in the Boy Scouts and then they all tricked him and like put this muzzle on him and I was like, oh my god! Like, yeah. And I feel like because of those scenes and the gravity of those scenes, it made the message all the more important by the end. I agree. I really do like though that it, like, it's nice to have a movie like bringing up like equality issues. Yeah, I love that it was a simple story. It was like... It was. She's a cop. She's trying to solve a case, yep. and there's like some moral and social lessons to be learned along the way. It made me want to play this movie as a video game. Oh, like interesting. Can't you imagine? Because I I love this video game, La Noir, which right. is like you play a detective in the '40s and you drive around. But like a Zootopia but Noir. Like a Zootopia like... Noir, right? So you're like. <laughs> You're like walking around with your with your fox cop, and you're like interviewing all these animals, right? Because I think I the, have a feeling they're gonna make that. I game. think the reason <laughs> that I felt that way is because the world was so established. I really felt like they thought about it. It's like it felt like a fully realized world. It There's did a too. few things that were weird, <laughs> like There's a few clunkers. So she comes into the police station for the first time, and the person that runs the desk goes, oh, you're a bunny, you're so cute. And she goes, a bunny can call another bunny cute, but when other animals do it, it's a little. <gasps> and I was like, really movie? Yeah. Like, really, we're doing this? Yeah, it was a little weird. I really liked that it didn't turn into, oh, now we have to fall in love. Yes. Between the bunny and the fox. Yeah, because that would have been weird. A, and I thought about it, and I was like, oh god, are they going to... would have been real weird. But also, I just feel like it would have undercut, like, the point of, like, their friendship. Yes. Like, I thought it showed a really nice progression of, like, a man and a woman's friendship, like, growing over time, and then, like, getting to know each other, and it didn't have to be like, now we're in love. Right. I was like, that's nice. Yes, like, that's a, nice. like, that's a nice, like, change. Yes. Does bring up a little bit of a weird question. <laughs> what would fox rabbit babies be like? Well, or like, I mean, so like, because it seems like there's not a lot of interspecies, inter interspecies breeding. No, it didn't. So, so then is that like a whole other issue where it's like, oh, well, no, we can't get together because you're not a rabbit? Yeah, they didn't bring that up. They didn't do like a ham-fisted gay marriage metaphor. Right, which you know? is good, I think. It was but good like, because they, they were focused on what they were focused on. Yes. They didn't try and fan it and out. And they kind of everything. distract you enough to not really have these kind of questions yes, until, like, until you pick several it glasses later. of wine in. Yes. So we haven't talked about one of my favorite things about this movie, which is that Shakira has oh a God. role. I'm Gazelle. Welcome to Zootopia. It starts off, she's like on the train, um, you know, headed to Zootopia. And she gets her little iPod Nano out and she picks Gazelle. It is wonderful. Amazing. Like, perfect. Yes. <laughs> and also I loved that montage of like the snow pizza. Oh, right? Yes. So she's like on this train and like she's like going, going through, through different these... zones yeah. of the town. It like, definitely has some snow pizza. Snow pizza. <laughs> going on. But yeah, so she plays a pop star and she gives like a speech about like equality and it's like fucking Shakira and it was like amazing. All of her backup dancers were tigers and I was um, like all of it. Who were like... Perfect. It was so, I don't know, I really enjoyed that. Yeah, that like, made me laugh a lot. We stayed for the whole credits watching this Shakira concert. Yes, it was amazing. <laughs> there, there was just enough of her. It was, it yes. It wasn't like, and now she's the main character who's no. like going to be on the adventure with them. No, no. I don't want it. No, yeah. it was great. So um, yeah, I, I really I would, liked it. I did too. I would say go see it. Um, Definitely go see it. It wasn't dumbed down. No, it's not like a kid It wasn't kid super movie. kiddy, and it, it was complex in its message. Yes, but kids will obviously enjoy clear. it. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I liked it a lot. Yeah. I would go see it. Yeah. I would like watch it again at some point. Yeah. 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 yeah.